NVIDIA just announced a new AI supercomputer, and when I say it's a game changer, I mean that literally because it will reinvent gaming as we know it. This thing is insane, guys. It's called the DGX GH200, and it's powered by 256 NVIDIA Grace Hopper superchips, which are like the ultimate combination of CPU and GPU on the same package. This supercomputer can handle terabyte class models for generative AI, recommender systems, and graph analytics, offering 144 terabytes of shared memory and one exaflop of performance. That's a million trillion operations per second. To put that in perspective, that's more than 10 times faster than the current fastest supercomputer in the world, which is also powered by NVIDIA GPUs, by the way. Honestly, NVIDIA is taking gaming to the next level with their new AI innovations. And in this video, I'm going to tell you all about how their new AI supercomputer is going to revolutionize gaming and beyond. So, NVIDIA has been leading the way in AI innovation for years, developing technologies that bring incredible advancements across various industries, such as gaming, healthcare, and autonomous vehicles. And lately, they've been coming up with a lot of new innovations like DLSS, Omniverse, Jarvis, and Maxine. But one of their most impressive innovations is the NVIDIA Avatar Cloud Engine Ace for games, which brings intelligence to non-playable characters, NPCs, through AI-powered natural language interactions. This technology allows NPCs to have realistic and dynamic conversations with players, responding to their questions and emotions in real time. So how does the new AI supercomputer fit into all this? Well, it turns out that creating these intelligent NPCs requires a lot of computing power and memory. The models that power these NPCs are very large and complex, and they need to be trained on massive amounts of data to learn how to generate natural language responses. That's where the DGX GH200 comes in. This supercomputer can handle these giant models with ease thanks to its massive memory space and incredible performance. And it can also enhance gaming experiences in other ways, like it can generate high-quality graphics and animations with generative AI techniques. It can also make the sound effects and music in games more realistic and exciting. To show you some examples of how the DGX GH200 can improve gaming, let me tell you about some specific games that have used NVIDIA's technology. One of the most anticipated games of 2020 was Cyberpunk 2077, a dystopian sci-fi RPG set in a futuristic city. This game was praised for its stunning visuals and immersive gameplay, but it also had some issues with bugs and glitches. One of the reasons for these issues was that the game had too many NPCs for the hardware to handle. The game had over a thousand NPCs in each scene, each with their own appearance, behavior, and dialogue. This was too much for the CPUs and GPUs of most PCs and consoles to process smoothly. That's why NVIDIA stepped in and helped CD Projekt Red the developers of Cyberpunk 2077, to optimize their game with their AI technology. NVIDIA used their DLSS technology to boost the frame rates and image quality of the game without compromising performance. They also used their AC for Games technology to make the NPCs more intelligent and responsive. They trained their models on thousands of hours of dialogue data from different sources, such as movies, books, podcasts, and social media. And then they deployed their models on the DGX GH200 supercomputer to process all this information in real time while you play the game. The result was amazing. The NPCs in Cyberpunk 2077 became more lifelike and engaging than ever before. They could have natural conversations with players based on their context and personality. They could also react to different situations and events in the game world dynamically. Another game that used NVIDIA's AI supercomputer was Half-Life. Alex, a VR first-person shooter set in the Half-Life universe, it delivered an incredibly immersive experience with realistic sounds and music generated on the fly. NVIDIA's technology created dynamic audio based on the player's actions and environment, making the game feel more lifelike. This made Half-Life one of the most realistic games ever. So all this means that we can expect more games to use NVIDIA's AI supercomputer to create more intelligent, realistic, and personalized experiences for players. It also means that we can expect new genres and modes of gaming to emerge with this technology. For instance, 
NVIDIA is looking into the idea of making interactive stories using AI language models. These models can generate stories that make sense based on what players input. To give you a glimpse of what this could look like, NVIDIA has collaborated with Convi, a company that specializes in conversational AI for gaming applications. They have created a demo called Kairos, which is an interactive story set in ancient Greece, where you play as a hero who has to save your city from an invasion. You can interact with various characters and influence the outcome of the story by choosing your actions and dialogue options. The demo uses NVIDIA's ACE for games technology to make the characters more intelligent and responsive. They can remember your previous interactions and adjust their behavior accordingly, and also express emotions and personality traits through their voice and facial expressions. Now I know many of you will ask me in the comments how you can get access to this technology. Well, NVIDIA has made it simple for game developers to use their ACE for games technology to create intelligent NPCs for their games. To use ACE for games, developers just need to give some basic information about their game, like what kind of game it is, where it takes place, who the characters are, and what they say. Then, NVIDIA will adjust their models specifically for that game using their huge collection of data and AI knowledge. Once the models are ready, Developers can deploy them via NVIDIA DGX Cloud, which is a cloud service that provides access to NVIDIA DGX AI supercomputers from a web browser. Developers can also deploy them on GeForce RTX PCs or on-premises, depending on their preference and budget. But gaming isn't the only area that can benefit from NVIDIA's new AI supercomputer. For instance, NVIDIA is collaborating with Mercedes-Benz to develop a software-defined vehicle platform. This platform uses NVIDIA DGX systems for training and NVIDIA Drive AGX Orin systems for real-time decision-making. It allows the car to continuously improve its abilities through updates and AI-powered features. NVIDIA's success and innovation in AI can be seen in how well their stock is doing. Their shares have been skyrocketing, reaching a new all-time high of $394.80 on May 26, 2023. This happened because the company had an amazing earnings report for the first quarter of fiscal 2024. They did even better than what analysts expected and raised their expectations for the second quarter. NVIDIA's revenue went up by a whopping 84% compared to the previous year, reaching $6.51 billion. This was because there was a big demand for their gaming, data center, and professional visualization products. Their net income more than doubled, reaching $2.31 billion, or $3.66 per share when diluted. NVIDIA's stock skyrocketed and lifted the whole tech industry with it. Investors are realizing the huge potential of AI and fast computing for different fields and purposes. As of May 26, 2023, NVIDIA's market value reached a staggering $939 billion, making it one of the most valuable companies globally and the top player in the chip industry. Some analysts predict that NVIDIA could become the first $1 trillion chip stock in 2023 if it continues to deliver on its AI vision and innovation. The remarkable performance of NVIDIA's stock shows that NVIDIA isn't resting on its past successes, but constantly pushing the limits of what can be achieved with AI. So, we can clearly see that NVIDIA's new AI supercomputer is a total game changer for gaming and beyond. It's a really powerful tool that lets us do incredible stuff with AI that we never imagined possible. It also shows how NVIDIA is a real leader in AI and always coming up with cool new ideas. I hope you liked the video and learned something cool. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and also leave a comment below and let me know your thoughts on this new AI supercomputer. I'm curious to know which game you'd like to see it being used in. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.